Well, it's the end of an era for a downriver community tonight. Demolition underway at the old Trenton Riverside Hospital. Our Jacqueline Francis is there and live. And Jacqueline, it appears that there are some mixed emotions out there. Yeah, right now there are people who are walking around the premises. People have been driving by all evening, taking pictures of the demolition so far. As you can see, it's still in its early stages. Only one chunk of the building has been really demolished so far. And while this progress is welcomed by city leaders like the mayor, for some in the community, it's a moment to say goodbye. Yeah, I'll miss it. I still remember those hallways, like, and watching it just come crumbling down is kind of sad, but... It's exciting to watch it too, you know, like, wow. There's no better way to describe it than bittersweet. The Trenton community bidding farewell to the building that was once Riverside Hospital. Opened in 1944, the hospital closed its doors in 2002. Neighbors remember it fondly. A lot of advantages in some way living by the hospital because you could use it, go to the cafeteria sometime in the morning and get our paper there sometimes. My mom and I both worked there. I worked there 10 years. My mom worked there over to 20 or 25 years. There was talk over the years about bringing the health care facility back to life, but those dreams were never realized. This past week, a bulldozer sealed its fate. It's sad, but it sat there so many years now. I don't think they could do anything with it anymore besides tear it down. The Trenton community looking towards the future of what could come of the riverfront property. I think everybody around here is pretty happy that something's got to change. But not before saying a heartfelt goodbye. We had a memorial over here just a few weeks ago just to kind of say goodbye and that kind of thing. The demolition will take a few months to complete. The big question on everyone's mind is what will come next? Well, that's yet to be decided. Reporting live in Trenton, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. All right, Jacqueline, thank you very much.